Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing um, a Marc Jacobs The Tote Bag unboxing slash kind of packing my bag-ish student edition um, slash content creator slash entrepreneur just on the go, that lifestyle or just on the go. You just want to make sure all the stuff that you need fits in one bag. That's not going to first of all hurt your, hurt your shoulder. Second of all um just have you out here looking crazy so here's my box i'm just really excited um so i like i said i'm really excited i literally ordered this on saturday tuesday he told me throw it back about i look really rich and let me know i'm not so proud of that Okay guys, so what I'm going to be doing is basically, because you guys know, I just unboxed my the tote bag. I'm really excited. It's really cute. Um, so this is what it looks like. Here I saw. It has this pouch that's attached on the inside. Um, and there's like two pockets here. And then a zipper at the top. The inside of the bag looks really good. The quality looks really durable. I'm really excited actually. I think this is a good use of my coin because I literally needed a brand new bag for school so that's literally why and I had my eye on this because I saw like just a lot of people getting it but just because it was like a useful bag like I like people were just being like really smart with their money um because if I'm fitting 2k 200 on a, I said 2k 200 on a bag it needs to be lasting me five ever so this is the bag I was using before it's this bag from Zara so what I was doing was I was just putting like my essentials in here, but I was carrying my laptop in my hand and I just couldn't do it anymore. So here, so these are like the main, so this is a three star, five star, a three subject, five star notebook that I just recently bought, not for class, but um, because I'm taking a certification and then there's like, so basically I just split up, I split it up in three categories. So the first part is for my certification. The second part was for my major, which is landscape architecture, because like I do readings and take notes and stuff. And then the last section was like self-development. So like I just read a lot of like self-development articles and that's where I keep all my notes. So that's why I got this journal. And then, um, I mean, notebook. And then, so this is my laptop. Um, so I just have an HP. And then I recently got this rocket book which is fire so basically you write with an erasable pen and you um can erase it and you can scan the pages it's very few pages but i kind of like that and i feel like i'm going to use it more as a planner or just as like a to-do slash organizational thing rather than a note-taking thing simply because i don't know how i feel about scanning each qr code every time i finish using it but i do think this has been helping me a little bit plan my day and just organize my day so i like that i like that it's small enough I can fit it inside my laptop sleeve and this protector is really good. I got it from Amazon a brand new, and it's been protecting my laptop since. So what we're going to do is be, we're going to load our the tote bag. So here's the bag. The first thing I'm going to put in is my laptop. You guys, I'm so excited. I finally got a bag that's like for me. There's my notebook. And then... I'm going to be putting in a few essentials. So here are my glasses. Um, I'm nearsighted, I believe. So I like just can't, um, like in lecturing stuff, if I just can't see the board, I'll put these on. Um, and I guess I can show you guys what they look like. 
they're DVF, Diane von Frossenberg. I worked in Nordstrom for a break and I really loved her. So when I got this on sale, I was really pressed. But this is what they look like and I just really love them. They're just really giving what they're supposed to give. Y'all, I love them. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna pop, I'm gonna put these, I think, in one of the little like sliding pocket thingies. Like, you guys see that? Now? Yeah, this pocket right here. I'm gonna put that here. Put it in this one. I don't know if it's good. Okay, that's good. So I have my AirPods. I'm gonna put the things that I want to be able to reach in and just grab inside this little zipper right here. So I'm gonna put my AirPods. Some chopstick. Um, and then I have this pouch here where I keep, it came with the Zara bag that I got that my sister got for me. Um, and inside I just like to keep like really important receipts. I have a cuticle oil pen that I use when um, I get my nails done. I haven't got my nails done in a brick, but this is like the cuticle oil pen. I like keeping this in my um, bag because cuticles be getting dry, y'all. Like, ugh. Then this is where I keep all my pens. I need to have different types of pens because I am a strong believer that if my handwriting does not look good, I will not retain information or I just won't be as excited to take notes. So my pens need to be fire. I have a few cards in here. I have um, this YSL Libre perfume, which I love. It smells so good. And then I have two lip liners. They're just brown ones for the days that I feel like doing the most. But am I really doing the most for them? No. So I'm gonna put this back in here. Everything fits so nicely. Um, so I'm gonna put this on the side of the bag. Then I have my actual like card holder where I keep like really like my important cards like my school ID like the debit cards I use Costco card and stuff like that so I'm going to also put that in the little zipper part um, okay so there's hella space in here still I also have some gum I'm going to just throw that in there I have another perfume um, that I probably don't need to have in here, but I really like this perfume and my mom doesn't like it, so she gave it to me, but this is what it's called. You probably can't see that, but I'm gonna link it below. It smells so good. And my friend used it the other day and she was like obsessed. So it smells really good. Very like, very like floral, but like, but it gives like boss to grown woman, you know? Just that type of vibe. Then I'm going to put my chargers in here. So my iPhone charger iphone charger <laughs> girl what are we doing as well as my um laptop charger i always keep my laptop charger on me baby i don't know what it is about hps i don't know if macs are like this but my laptop is always dying so i really need to keep my charger on me so that's that oh also the bag came with this little like i guess like aftercare instructions um and it has like um it just says with the trim like the material the trim the garniture the body is made out of 100% cotton it says is mark jacob's product was crafted using unique materials we recommend this product be handled with special care to make sure your bag um remains beautiful as long as possible you recommend when not in use stuff and store this accessory avoid contact with any water or oily substances we do not recommend the use of cleaning products on your handbags please avoid ink marks oil stains permanent dyes as they're not removable I'm so excited. I'm actually gonna keep this um not in the bag, but like upstairs or something. My room. So there's that. I'm gonna put my keys. My keys also. I'm gonna put that in the little zipper. Then I have some um spray deodorant and some hand cream. Now I don't really always like use hand cream, um, but everyone around me does so I like keeping it because when they ask me like I can just you know here, here boo so we're gonna throw all that in there then I'm very big um not my bones telling me it's on 10% excuse me I'm very big on hair ties like I first of all I know I need to stop like I always keep my hair tied back but it's just so much better than having them in my base. Like, it's a really big distraction for me. So I'm going to keep, I have three big hair ties. I got these from the beauty supply store, as well as a hair clip. I like using hair clips on my hair straight, though, because that's not going to hold my hair when it's curly. 
Um, so one more thing is my sunglasses case, even though the sunglasses are in the car, but we're gonna put that in here too. So let's see. Another thing that I also always keep in my bag is a scarf. Um, I love tying my hair. Like I've told y'all I love tying my hair. So I always keep a scarf in my bag. So I just like fold it really neatly and just like put it in there because you just never know. And sometimes when my hair is straight too, like I just don't look at the weather and like this will actually like save me, save my hair from frozen up. So I have everything in the bag. We're gonna set this baby up. Oh, hold on, honey. Let's see what she's getting. Not Sam. So this is what she's getting. Norman Freeman is my icon, as you can tell. Oh, I forgot. Thank you so much. Thank you. USB, baby. I always keep USB on me. So I'd be dealing with really large files, so I'm gonna throw that in the zipper. But you guys, I think it's giving. I think, I think the tote bag is giving. Okay, so I'm gonna put this on my arm. Let's see how heavy she is. Oh, and see if I actually want to. Okay. So how I feel, not me cutting myself. How I feel is, I guess like, ugh, if I'm like going to the grocery store, I don't want to carry this. I was trying to find a bag that was like just good for like ever you know what I'm mean? like for every use for like any moment of my day so this is a little heavy which makes sense I think I put a lot in here but I'm gonna just test it out and see how I'm really feeling um but I do like the overall structure quality of the bag um I'm not sure if the price point is too high because it's Marc Jacobs it's probably why but it's nice. It's nice, you know. Um, I think I just need to use it and see how I feel. Um, but for now, I do wish it had... Um, I can't think of... What is it called? Like the... Um, <laughs> girl. It's like a slash. The slash, like the... Um, Wow, whatever, whatever longer um, strap, whatever the long strap is. Um, I wish it had that, but I think it's okay. Y'all, I sound so disappointed, but I think it's okay. Um, I'm excited to use it. I'm just excited though. I feel like at the end of the day, like it's going to be sturdy. The straps won't break. And that's really what I wanted to like. I replaced so many bags because the shops broke so I can tell with this because it's like a canvas tote it's not gonna happen but yes y'all I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope it gave you some of what of a feel of what you can fit in it also with everything in this bag I still have like half like if I wanted to put maybe like three more notebooks in here I could definitely do that there's a lot of space in here so yes guys overall I would rate it I would rate it a nine out of ten Maybe I'm just being biased because I'm wise is so heavy on my arm, but it's like, girl, you have like so much in there. So let me just say that. But um, yeah, I hope you guys, I hope if you're an entrepreneur or a student or a content creator, you're on the go. And if you're worth thinking about getting this bag, I say go for it. Um, Cause you get what you pay for. And um, I'm pretty sure there's also warranty and stuff. If you don't like your return it. <laughs>